So I'm gonna do a bit of a challenge today. I'm gonna to try and get 15 fish on nymphs and 15 fish on dry flies. I think it's an ambitious but not unreasonable challenge, so let's see how close we can get. The brown on the bunny. Oh, dropping my net. All right, one on the nymph. Not a bad one. Cool. That's four nymphing. I still feel like we haven't fished the front end. Wow. How many fish are down there, guys? Oh, just popped out. Perfect. It's a nice brown. Yeah. Number 11. Just got a dry fly fish on the board, yeah? Where's my net? Yeah. Best fish of the day so far is corn fed midge fish. Yeah, that's 16, 17, that's number six, he's landed. Alright guys, this is part two, if you haven't seen part one, I'm trying to catch 15 fish on a nymph and 15 fish on a dry fly today. So far we're at 11 fish on the nymph and six on the dry fly, it's about 12.30, I had to walk about 20 minutes downstream because the river is so packed today. But I think I got myself some room. Let's see if we can finish off this challenge. All right, like earlier, I've got a Bunny Royale and Harry Zebra Jig on. If we could pick up four fish out of this little deep run, we'd finish off the nymphing and we can go seek out some more dry fly fish. I thought there might be some rising fish in the spot below me, but there's not. So we might need to go searching. Hopefully we can finish off the nymphs in here. All right, I'm just gonna do a little prospecting in here. Just a little bit. There we go. Okay. Number 12 on the nymph. Okay. On the bunny. Anyways, let's uh, catch this rising fish ahead of us, yeah? I'm gonna throw some blind casts first. And just see if I can pick up some fish that haven't shown themselves. There are a few more fish working. Oh, that's a nice fish, guys. I don't want to cast up to them yet because I think there should be other fish in here. Nothing, huh? Yep. We got him that time. Oh, that's a that's a nice brown. Oh, it's a real nice brown. That's bigger than I thought when I saw him. Oh yeah, three way. See if I can keep him out of the current. 
unfortunately it's going to kind of take me where he wants. Get him up? Nope. Yes, that's a nice ground, guys. <laughs> that's a much bigger fish than I thought was right there. <laughs> much bigger. Man, that's fun on this three weight. That is so fun. So that's number seven. Like a 17 inch ground. Oh. I put a black one on. Probably won't do pictures every time I switch. But just know I'm alternating. Yep, one came up there. Just know I'm alternating. Ooh, a couple more. Just know I'm alternating. Finish my sentence. Just know I'm alternating between flashy, high vis, and black. I fish all three. I usually start with the flashy and then kind of test the others from there. But black was working earlier. Yeah, I think that one big fish got put put down the rest of them once he, he kind of ran through the whole thing. Yeah, I think that drift would have gotten the other ones. Okay, let's go after this one on the left and then we got one farther up straight ahead of us. But the one on the left is like right... That's probably like a foot wide of his lane. So, to the left. Let's see if we can, ooh, see if we can make a better cast. Yep, we did. <laughs> that's another nice brown. Get tight. So this is eight, right? Another solid one. I'm surprised if he's a little wrapped, he's doing death spirals. Let's see. Yeah. Man, quality fish. Alright, we've got some more rising fish in front of me in this run. They're kind of on this closer edge. Yeah, right in the riffly stuff. That one's pretty close to me. Probably shouldn't walk up any more than I am. There's a lot of fish in here rising, actually. Oh, no. What are we on, eight dry fly fish? Oh, let's not choke now. I think I kind of stung that fish. He's not coming back. Oh, that's a nice fish. Yeah. Yeah.
These aren't small ones, guys. Yes. Oh, and the fly came out. And it might be savable. That one's a little skinny, but that's a solid dry fly fish. Go, buddy. Swim. Okay. Oh, yeah. Porpoised for it. I made one last cast of that fish and it paid off. That's 10. All right, I still feel confident picking up some nymph fish through here. Oh, it's a nice fish. Why do you brown? Oh, it's like brown. Okay. I feel like my hook set wasn't that great. Oh, got him anyway. Number 13, that's a nice brown. Oh, I took the bunny, I think. Let's see. Nope. It's a nice brown. All right, I'm trying to sneak in here. I got a tree to my back right, so I got to do a off shoulder cast here. But there are three or four nice browns working in this tail out. Yep, there's one. There's another one. See if we can get the back one first. I'll be happy if I pull one out of here because I think the, catching one will put him down. Oh, let's dial in this uh, off shoulder cast, huh? That was closer. Still a little behind. Oh, that wasn't it mine. That's a good cast. Feel like I lined that fish though. Let's keep him out. Nope, no chance. No freaking chance. <laughs> We're keeping him out of there. That's a nice fish. Oh, well, maybe I should have brought the five weight. Yes, guys. Corn fed midge. 
there's still one rising up there. We didn't blow out the whole pool. There you go. Okay guys, that was number 11. Nice fish. We did a, actually ended up doing a very good job of keeping him out of the, oh, we're all wrapped up around the rod here. Keeping him out of the pod, because I have seen a few more rising fish up ahead of him. So, well executed that time. Yep. Good. You know, if we could unwrap our leader here. Get the fly line through. Okay. Okay. And let's make a cast, yeah? Still going over my left shoulder. Make one short one to dial it in. I don't... Ooh. Ooh. That's a big fish. That's a big fish. That's not in his lane. Still got one. No, we got the small one. That's not good. That's not good. Okay. I'm going to call that 12. Yes. Well... I don't think I kept that one out of the pod. <laughs> nice fish though. Look at the three weight. This guy is angry. Oh, I don't want him downstream now. In the net. Oof. <laughs> Man, that's a pretty fish. It's a, it's a gorgeous fish. See, three weight, six X, still short landing time. That's fun. 13. Still fish rising in there. And if we can get two more, we finished our dry fly fish. Still doing the steeple cast. Oh yeah. Oh, that's a big fish. Oh, that's a big fish. Come on. Huh? Maybe not as big as I thought. Still a nice fish. Where's my net? Oh, that's a pretty one. Not a giant. I originally thought that was a big, big one. Just angry. That's number 14. The, use the big camera. Yeah. Stick. There we go. It's not a bad one. Get him out of that swift water. 
Harry zebra jig. Okay, that's fine. 13. Yeah. It's not a bad one. Oh, came off. Let's call that a soft 15. <laughs> so soft victory. Let's, let's try and catch one more. You know, the last one should be not a tweener. All right, Nymphish, where are you at? There we go. That's a nice brown. Ooh. that 14 almost there mm -hmm. on the bunny ah that's a nice one Oh, no, 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 it's a fish. Oh, we got the bite. All right, guys, the last two and a half hours have been a grind. You know, I thought we were on pace to just easily get this done. And now here we are, we're at the last spot. I've got to make it to fly fish food to get some tying material so I have a hard out here so it's gonna come down to this spot now it's not the best but maybe we can pull one of the fish that hangs out in this deep little pool looking for one fish bottom well I couldn't get it done in the end you know we're one fish short we got 14 on the nymph and 15 on dries 15 ish I really wanted that last one but Sometimes it just doesn't go your way. I had the bite at the end and didn't get a hook into him. So we were just shy, but it was a fun challenge and 
I hope you guys enjoyed this video. There's some nice fish caught on dries. If you uh, like this video, please like it down below and consider subscribing to my channel. Thanks.